all started when I was playing with um, two of my friends, Ultra and Wolfrey Buck. They're pretty act, somewhat active in the scene, and we all learned the game together. We started playing on GGPO just because we liked the game, and um, we we played it a lot. That that became um, Skillionaire, and well, even prior to Skillionaire, I was playing it a lot with Hardbread and and Rithley and a couple of others. Like I used to bring my PS2, just come out to the next level, It'd take like a, an hour and a half, two hour ride all the way from uptown Manhattan to Brooklyn just to play two people in VSAP. And it just became a thing. Like I never, I never cared. I just wanted to keep playing. And then came um, NEC, where a bunch of guys in Cincinnati wanted, to, you know, challenge us. And we had the 7v7, and it like completely opened me up to like the whole scene. Pick your character. Find what character suits you. Look up the guides. Watch players. Watch a lot of Japanese players. Um, you know, there's a lot of players out there. You could always ask the VSAP community. VSAP, Vampire Savior community on Facebook. Yeah, we're a very helpful community. Nobody tries to shit on each other or high tech or like be superior to one another. It's just, we all want to share tech. We want to grow the community. We want to like keep playing with people. We just want to, we want it to grow. Even though it's a very niche game, we got, we're playing on either cab or PS3 360. It's very hard, but make the effort. You know, if you really want to play the game, you make the effort. I'm, I'm super hype about it. The pop bonus alone, like, okay, that, that's cool and all, that's a very good incentive, but like, it's a 3v3 Pokemon style, you got a lot of killers coming through. Um, I'm not gonna say I want like, my team to win, I would love my team to win, but there's like, I don't care, man, I just wanna fuck everybody up. It's like, that's how I, that's how I see it. I see everybody as food, and I just know it's gonna be a bloodbath.